My name is Marina Abramovic and I'm a performance artist. Live in New York so far. Performance is timeless art, it's a material form of art. And it's not like a painting, you, 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 you put the nail on the, on the wall, you hang the painting and the next day you come back and it's still there. But here, because it's time-based, you have to be in the place, in the situation where this is happening. The present is the only reality we have, there's no any other reality. And when once you are in that present, your consciousness starts changing. And you see clearly the as world as it is, and not as we're projecting it. It's so transcendental that you can actually create that space that enter everything who is in the room, enter into that moment. So it's, it's the performer and the public become one body, one entity. And that are the most remarkable moments, and I have them. And you know, I'm always so afraid that I will not get there when I was young. And now I trust it because I learned so much. I could never do this performance that I actually do nothing sitting on the chair when I was young. Because when you're young, you need so much material. You need the objects, you need this, you need that. You need just kind of to hide behind your insecurity. Because you say, okay, what I can do? Just sit on the chair. I mean, what people just will not, they'll go away. But when you get really to understand that it's about energy, then you know that you don't need anything. And that's as simple as that. Technology took all our time and make us completely disbalanced. You used to write the letters, and you write the letter with the pen and you put in the envelope, and then you make a little walk, probably with your dog, to the post office, and then you deliver a letter. And then you wait uh, for, I don't know, five, six days to get the answer. Then you wait another three days to write the answer back. I mean, how many people take medic medications? How many people can't sleep without sleeping pills? How many people suicide? How many people are depressed? I mean, they're just numbers. It's, it's, it's incredible. I, I mean, we don't have any more any concentration. We don't have any more our center. We can't see one television program from the beginning to the end, like they're changing channels. There is something incredibly wrong, because with this kind of pace, I mean, we are not happy. You have to make really radical decisions when everything has to stop to go into that kind of state of reality, which is now. In my point of view, it's very important to, to know why you are here. And it's very important to have the, the mission, because you know the people have to know what, what is their medium to do things. You know, some great people are great gardeners, some are bread makers, some are politicians. I, I was artist, I started painting, but very early I started understanding the performance is my tool. But I think mission is very important. Mission and uh, to understand what is purpose in it. What, what you're supposed to do here on this planet. It's not just you are there to be spoiled and, and hang around with no purpose. I don't think so.